Have you ever tried a love spell? We have it thanks to Kate Froiler and it's called Love Spell Mist. What do you need? You just need a misting bottle. I thought it was the, the thing of the <gasps> asthma, but it's not like that. It's, you can use a spray. A half cup of rose water, three fresh rose petals, one cleansed rose quartz, and one tablespoon uh, sugar of sugar. And this spell is designed to welcome all forms of love into your life, including the unexpected. What do you have to do? Combine the, the ingredients, uh, rose water, rose petals, and rose quartz in the misting bottle. Place it in direct sunlight and sprinkle the sugar around it in the shape of a heart. Leave the bottle for three days to absorb the loving rays of the sun. On the third day, hold the bottle in your hands and visualize a vaporous pink glow surround it. This glow is filled with many kinds of love, without judgment or labels. Each day, open your door or windows and spray the mist into the openings, imagine them glowing bright pink. Recite, open door, open mind, the love I seek will soon be mine. Wait and see who walks through your door. Uh, I'm totally agree with the, with the author. She said, uh, when we're searching for love, we often have a fixed notion of what that should look like, an expectation that can end up standing in our way, and it's totally like that. I, I, that happened to me, and I know many people that is, they are like that. Their expectations and their, their, their list of requirements are so many, and you know, it's, it's very difficult to fix in that uh, per perfect, um, image that they uh, created. So uh, I think this is a very good choice to start to change those, uh, this pattern, this uh, way of thinking, because it's not going to help you if you keep thinking like that. You have to understand that everyone uh, we are imperfect, we, made, we make mistakes, and we evolve, and we have to transform ourselves during time. And when you find a partner that he, uh, he or she is available to do that, that is a very good choice, uh, like a, a romantic partner, not that perfect person that you want, and it, it should look like this, and you have to be like this. No, you have to, you are um, closing doors, and you are cutting your possibilities to have a, a, a good life with some someone and yeah it's good to have some criteria some expectations but not at the, le at the level that they are so high that they ended uh, transforming in a um, in something that sabotage or your future and your life